Hello everyone and welcome back to Fun Mathology. Today's topic is how to draw an angle of 45 degree, 75 degree, 90 degree, 105 degree, 135 degree and 195 degree with compass only. So let's see how to do them. So see I have made four sections to draw these angles. So let us go to the first section, right? So I have already drawn a line segment AB for the reference to draw the angle. So let's go to the first section with A as center. Try to remember how to draw a 90 degree. So we'll draw a 90 degree, right? So we'll, we'll draw the arc. Got it. So we'll cut it here. We'll take this as center. We'll cut the arc in the second position. We'll draw another arc with this as the center with the same radius without changing the radius you have seen. We'll draw this intersection arc. So this is the, the first one. What is this? See if we take this as the mark, let's say as C. So A and C if we join them. So we will get this as 90 degree. So we got 90 degree, right? So we got 90 degree with just the help of compass. And we have seen this in my earlier lectures. Now, after drawing this 90 degree, if I bisect this 90 degree, 90 divided by 2 is 45 degree. So we will draw 45 degree by bisecting this 90 degree. So bisection is simple as we have seen previously. So we already have an arc. So without changing this radius, see the arc is intersecting in the line segment AB at this point. So take this as center, draw an arc here. And you can see at AC, the arc is intersecting at some point. So take that as center and try to intersect this arc. Got it? So we'll mark the intersection point. Always mark the intersection point for clarity. Now join this and this. So we'll join this and this. Got it? So we have bisected 90 degree and what we have got? So now we have got this angle as 45 degree. Got it? So let's check with the... So see, it is 45. See, it's between 40 and 50 and it is passing through 45. Got it? So we got 45. Now see, if I add, see this is a 90 degree, right? This is a 90 degree. If I add 45 degree to this 90 degree, what we will get? We will get 135. So let's extend this one. Let, let us extend AB. Right? Now this is 90, so let us again bisect it. The arc is already there, so you don't have to arc, uh, draw the arc second time. So see, take this as center, you draw an arc here. So take this as center, the ex uh, where this arc is cutting in the extended portion of AB. Take this as center and draw an intersection arc. So now mark this point join it so now join this this one and this one now i have bisected this one right as per the steps that we have seen earlier in my lectures and in this class also 
like I have bisected for 90 degree to 45. So I have bisected this 90 degree into 45 and 45. So this angle is 45. So if I add 90 and 45, it comes to 135. So now this whole angle is 135 degree. So we have seen how to draw 45, 90 and 135. Let's come to the second section. So we will see how to draw 75 degree. Now I have already drawn a line segment. So take A as center and try to draw a 60 degree, right? Let's draw a 60 degree. So this is 60 degree we have seen in earlier classes. So if we join them, so it will be 60 degree. Got it? Let us draw 90 also. In a similar way that we have seen here. Got it? So this is 90 and this is 60, right? So let us join them. So join the point of intersections. So this is the point I will be joining with A to form 90 and this will be the point I will be joining with A to form 60. Right? So let us join them. This is 90 and this is A. We will join it. So we will name it as C. So we got this as 90. Right? And this will be joining See this one and this one and this one now we got this is as 60 right so what is remaining means if I subtract 60 from 90 this is 30 right so 90 minus 60 is 30 see if I bisect this 30 I'll get 15 so if I add 16 60 and 15 I'll get 75 so let's bisect this 30 degree angle how to bisect very simple we have seen so we'll extend this one we'll take this as center and we'll have another intersection arcs so we will, you know, mark this point and we will join this. So now, see, this is 30 and this is 30. So if I, sorry, this is 15 and this is 15. I have divided, bisected the angle of 30 degree. So this is 15 and this is 60. So in total, this one will be. 75 degree got it so we have learned how to draw 75 degree now let's come to the third section so in a similar way we will be drawing constructing 105 degree so first of all go ahead and draw a 90 degree so we'll draw a 90 degree so we'll draw 90 degree as usual so we'll join this one and this one will have 90 degree this one and this one right so we'll name this as point c right so now we have this and as 90 degree now we'll be drawing 105 degree right so 105 degree minus 90 becomes so 105 degree minus 90 becomes 15 degree so i need a 15 degree here so what to do so let us extend ab so let us extend ab 
so we have extended AB. Now see, from this point, from this point, if I draw an arc, see, it is intersecting with this one. So this one means this is the point. If I join with this one, it will form a 60 degree from this side, from the left hand side, right? So the remaining will be what? 30. So if, if I divide this angle, this one will form 15 degree. So if I add 90 plus 15, it will form 105. So I'll divide this one and this one. I'm not joining this and extending this. Okay. So, so this is the mark point and let us join this one. So this one, this one. So now you have this as 15 and this as 90. So in total, you will be getting 105. Got it? So let's check it out from this one and this one. So we haven't checked this one, right? So we'll check this one, see. It's 90. So this is 60. And see, this is 75, right? Between 70 to 80. So you have successfully drawn it. So let us check this one. See. 105 degree right see this is 90 and this is 100 and this is 110 and in between this is 105 degree got it so we have accomplished 45 90 75 105 and 135 now how to draw 195 degree got it so let's see how to draw 195 degree now what we will do is, see, I have already draw, drawn a line segment, right? So this is a line segment and I have taken a point in between it and named it as O. So we will draw, what we will draw a 90 degree from this O here, thick. So how to draw? So you know it. Take this O as center. You know, draw an arc. Now, take this as center, draw an arc here, and draw an arc here, draw an arc here, and draw the intersection arc here. Got it? So, if you, if you join this, you will get the 90 degree got it so this one let's name it as C so this A so CO is perpendicular to AB so this is 90 degree right so we will be drawing 195 degree right so 180 if I subtract 180 from 195 what will you get you will get 15 degree so I already have 180 degree here. So I need to have a 15 degree here. Got it? So how to do? See. I'll take this without changing the radius. So let us imagine. This one is 90, right? So if I take this as center and draw an arc here. If I join this one and this one. So what will you have? You will have 60 here, right? So the remaining angle is 30, this one. So I'll join it and then show it to you. So this one is 60 degree. So the remaining angle is 30 degree. So we'll divide this one. So we'll take this intersection point and 
will join this with O now this one is 15 degree and this hole is 180 degree in total what will you have you will have Ninety-five degree. Got it? So we have seen without using protractor, just using the ruler compass, we will. Uh, you have drawn. We have drawn forty-five degree, seventy-five degree, ninety degree, one hundred five degree, one thirty-five degree, and one ninety-five degree. Okay. So that's all for today, students. See you in the next lecture. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.